In politics, the speculation about who might run for what and when never really ends. In Wisconsin these days, there's plenty of speculation about the 2018 U.S. Senate race. And one of the most talked about names is that of today's first guest, Wisconsin Congressman Sean Duffy. So I asked Duffy if he's thinking about getting into the race. Yeah, I was just elected to another term in the House. I live in Warsaw. I, I love the place that I live and the people that I represent. Um, a run for the Senate is challenging. I, I've got eight kids. Um, so uh, I've heard the same rumors you have. I haven't made any determinations um, on what I'm doing you know, in the future with regard to political races. I have a big subcommittee uh, in House Financial Services. Uh, so uh, all doors uh, are open. But uh, again, I like, my, I like my job, Mike, and I've got a great place in the House and we're doing big things at a, at a really uh, interesting time in American politics. So um, again, eight kids. <laughs> That's a lot. <laughs> Duffy's answer, however you interpret it, will be noted by the Democratic incumbent, Senator Baldwin, but also by other Republicans. Senate Majority Leader Scott Fitzgerald told me in early December that he wanted to avoid a repeat of 2012, when a hard-fought four-way primary cost the GOP winner, Tommy Thompson, valuable time and money. If Duffy runs, he might clear the field, but if he doesn't, we could be looking at another interesting GOP primary battle 18 months from now. Thanks for being with us today. I'm Mike Boucher, and I'll see you again next week on Upfront. You can see today's program on our website. Just click on the Upfront section of WISN.com.